Raw Hope the Punch Out Boxing here with Nick Ball. Nick, first of all, I've got to admire your stoicism. You know, after that Vargas fight, yeah, you took it in your stride. Some fighters have gone away, cried about it, but straight back on it. Yeah, straight back on it, straight back in the gym. And, um, working hard, yeah. Um, it is what it is, what happened, everyone knows. Uh, that's in the past and I'll leave it where it's at. Yeah, one of them things, I can't change it, so on to the next, yeah. When you reflect on that performance, uh, do you think that you did anything wrong or things that you can do better that you now know at the top level matter? Yeah, you can always do things better. You're always learning in the gym every day and you learn on the fights, in the sparring sessions. You're always learning and that's a good thing about it. You know, you're learning and improving. And I'm at this level now through listening and learning to the, to the people around me. Yeah? And that's the main thing. Continue to keep doing what what got me here, working hard. How, uh, how soon after that Vargas fight was uh, this second opportunity for a world title presented to you? Yeah, soon. Um, it was all set up within like a week, the week after. So, yeah, back in the gym, ready to go. Oh, right, a week. Only a week to sulk, but, but you weren't sulking, so it didn't matter. So well, that's brilliant. But obviously, Ford's a totally different fighter, slick mover. Um, yeah, I remember we spoke. I think it was more than a year ago at Copper Box. You said those negative fighters won't be able to keep away from you for, for long. No, you confident you'll catch up with him? Yeah, 100. percent Yeah, I'll catch up with any any fighter. You can you can tie with the time for the for the certain few rounds, but I'll catch up with them. My um, my engine's different. From his last fight, do you rate his skill set? Yeah, of course. He's a world champion. Isn't he? He's gonna become world champion if that's not the case. So he's a he's a good fighter. Yeah. What do you make of the, the size factor? I think he looks a bit big there, which could work against him, struggling to make weight two camps in a row. Yeah, it's not big in the bag, that's though, is he? So, um, yeah, he's a bit smaller, so I'm sure I won't, uh, sure I won't find it hard. Uh, I'm, I'm sure you're not the sort of guy that worries about size <laughs> anyway. As long as you can reach him, you, you, you'll be happy. Um, yeah, uh, second opportunity for a world title then. Um, how's it end? Yeah. Um, in a in a win, Nick Ball win, yeah, and Queensbury and Queensbury win, yeah, five one win, yeah, whatever you want to call it. Extra point for the knockout, of course. Um, yeah. But also, how, how's uh, Brad? Uh, not too disappointed after his uh, fight with um, with uh, McCann, is he? Um, no, you know, it's one of them things, isn't it? It is what it is. That's that's also happened now, and yeah, you can't you can't um, sit around and suffer about it. You've got to stay back in the gym and stay back to it and that's what he will be doing yeah next week uh pain finally back so uh hopefully uh yeah could have a full house at the everton red triangle and yeah going from strength to strength all right oh, you guys yeah that's it that's exactly in it strength to strength and then um, yeah come on for the, the top spot all of us all right get that world title we can't wait to see a big show with you headline me in liverpool we'll, yeah. uh, thanks for your time and uh Hopefully I'll see you in Saudi Arabia in about a month. Yeah.